And yeah. you know what? You can start it out without having to, you don't have to spend like years to develop mm -hmm. the skill set. Anybody out there doesn't know what pickleball is, it's sort of like a wiffle combination ball. of ping, 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 ping pong, pong and tennis. Yeah. Tennis yeah. with a wiffle ball. There you go. Me or I'll just start Harvey. Good day to pickle today. <laughs> it, it definitely is. I'm like you, John. I have never had uh, the opportunity to participate in any pickleball. So we got to get together and do that today. Perfect opportunity to be outdoors doing anything uh, that your heart or mind could even think of. We are starting off today with lots of clouds in place, but the good news is that we do have the possibility of seeing some of those peaks of sun across the tri-state. In addition to that, we also have uh, the possibility of a stray shower moving across the area between that 11 and 2 o'clock hour. But most of those showers are expected to stay across portions of South Jersey. Now, temperature wise, we are shooting for about 10 degrees or so above where we are usually at for this time of the year. And then we do have some of those humidity and dew point levels that are sitting a little higher this morning. But as our front pushes through for the second half of our day, we'll notice that things are a lot more drier as well as cooler. Now today across our boroughs, look at there in Staten Island. We are talking upper 70s, a low 80s. That's going to be the case across Brooklyn, Queens, Harlem, wherever you're at. We are talking upper 70s to low 80s. Very similar across portions of Jersey as well. Edison coming in at 80 and Jackson there at 77. Even the Hudson Valley wanted a part of this warm weather today. We're seeing 80 across not just Cold Springs, but also Poughkeepsie there. 74 in Liberty. Now again, we do expect to see most of these cloudy conditions across the area, but we'll see those uh, cloud icons sticking around most parts of our island today, still managing to make it into the mid uh, 70s to upper 70s. Humidity wise, I have us at the nine o'clock hour here. Notice that we do have percentage wise 40s to the Hudson Valley. The further south you go, we start to see those percentages increasing like across portions of North uh, Jersey, across uh, Central Park there in the 50s, across Jersey Shore there in the 70s. But moving into that three o'clock hour as this front moves through, it does have the possibility of becoming stationary. All in all, we still do expect that those humidity levels will drop, making it a lot more comfortable outdoors. Other than lots of clouds uh, this morning, we do have some of that wet weather hanging out to uh, the west of us. Expected to continue to move off to the southeast. But again, there goes our front right there. Expected to drop down again, possibly becoming stationary. All in all, still going to make things cooler and drier. Nine o'clock hour, we see some of those stray showers moving through. You'll see a lot of that moisture did remain to not just Ocean County, but also Monmouth County. Again, stray showers getting us through at least a little part of the seasoning. But for the most part, we should remain dry. Rain total, total amounts, we're talking anywhere from a trace to about a tenth of an inch. And we get to Mother's Day tomorrow. Things are looking nice as well. Plenty of sunshine temperatures for the start of next week. Still on the warmer side, but dropping back down on Wednesday.